piqued my curiosity. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's get going! Welcome to the cat's tail. Ah, <laughs> it's the Traveler and Paimon. What a nice surprise. Oh, and Sucrose the Alchemist. It's been a while, hasn't it? <laughs> I'm afraid I've already told you before. Fur from the cat's tail staff is not for sale, no matter how much mora you offer. <laughs> Don't worry, Margaret. We're not here for that research project I told you about last time. Sucrose, what kind of experiment were you trying to do with the cat's tail? Uh, oh, I just wanted to test out some hypotheses, and I needed some materials. But uh, we can talk about that later. Actually, Margaret, we're here to learn more about Genius Invocation TCG. Ah, Genius Invocation TCG. We were just talking about that game. You see, more and more people have been gathering at the Cat's Tail to play, so I thought, why not have a dedicated staff to serve the new customers? Speaking of which, I believe you've already met. Hmm? Met who? You know, Prince. This is the Cat's Tail after all, so I thought having a cat take care of our new customers would be quite a nice touch. Ah, allow me to interpret. <clears throat> Prince says that the word customer is much too loose of a term, and we should instead refer to anyone who loves dueling with cards as TCG players. Hmm, <laughs> my mistake. So it seems I haven't introduced you yet. This is Prince and Shuyin. They will be in charge of taking care of our TCG players. Ah, I'm afraid I must correct you there, ma'am. Only Prince, the strongest and most formidable TCG player of all, is capable of providing valuable guidance to our new players. The average player is incapable of grasping the subtlety and sheer genius behind Prince's every play, and he has no choice but to rely on me to communicate with everyone. I am merely Prince's lowly assistant, that's all. Wow! Another guy who can understand animals! How can you use such a crude word as animal to describe the one and only Prince? He is special and the only one of his kind. Such a remark is an insult to Prince. Yeah. Oh, what's that? Shu Yen, in the eyes of the common folk, I look no different than any other ordinary cat. It's a natural mistake to make and you shouldn't overreact. Ah, understood. I do apologize. Hmm. It seems he really is capable of communicating with the cat. Could this be the result of some modification to the language center of his brain? Seriously, how can he get all of that from a simple meow? 